tonight is the grand premiere of the highly anticipated movie Banana Island Ghost. And it definitely marks another collective win for the entire industry that is Nollywood. Now this movie stars Patrick Diaboa and Chi Girl. And it's about a ghost that wrecks havoc in Banana Island. It's a very interesting storyline, one that we've never seen before in Nollywood. So it's definitely going to be very exciting to see how it all plays out. I'm Mimi Onolaja, this is VVIP Events, and we're about to have a lot of fun. Why would you come up with the idea of a ghost running around Banana Island? We really, really wanted to do something different in the comedy genre, right? And blend sort of action, adventure, and all that stuff. And so, what will we call it? We can't call him a Jigonle ghost. So, you know what? Let's call him Banana Island Ghost. And boom, off to the races. I loved the idea of sort of retelling a story about a ghost, sort of almost redefining how we do ghosts. And also too, like, I mean, growing up, I grew up with Casper the Ghost, which is a friendly ghost. And I feel like in Nigeria, we never have like positive ghost stories. So this was really a nice, and also I wanted to have a film with a female lead and this was just perfect for that. Is there any behind the scenes action that you can tell us? Anything that happened that would absolutely surprise us from your time filming Banana Island Ghost? I was particularly amazed by the way my, my gunshot scenes were shot, you know? It's something new. I've never seen anything like that before in a Nollywood movie. So uh, I trust everybody will love it. Ijama in the film um, is a woman who is, she has three days to get 18 million naira. And she is a go-getter, she's a hustler, she's working many jobs, trying to, to, to keep herself sane, trying to make this money, trying to take care of people and everything. So she's sort of like, in a, in a, she finds herself in such a dilemma, trying to get this money together. And that's when Mr. Ghost comes into her life. And so he also has three days to find a soulmate. So there's a transaction that happens between them. And that's what this movie sort of like shows us. And in, this, in, the, in that process, we find ourselves doing funny things and just, it's all kinds of craziness, all kinds of craziness. The three reasons why you should watch Banana Island Ghost is because number one, it is action packed. For those of you who love action movies, you've never seen a real great action movie in Nigeria before. But we got it this time. Number two, it's funny, it's amazing. It has Chigol, it has Saeed Balogun, it has myself in it. Number three, because you'll go home happy that you spent so so and so amount on a movie and you'll be like, ah ah, it's even cheap. So yeah. If you were to play a role in this movie, Ima, what role would that be? I, I can't say till I finish watching it. By now, I won't be the ghost. No, I'm, I was just about to tell you that you will be the ghost. <laughs> I think you will make a good Banana Island ghost. <laughs> no, no, no. It is mainland. Maybe a Koro duo. No, it can't be. Solo ghost. <laughs> no bad no action. I swear, man. No, man. Now, the red carpet area, it was fun, but that was mainstream. This is VVIP events, and we always do it a little differently. So I'm about to take you where no other camera is going to go tonight. I'm about to show you where the real action is going down right here at the Banana Island Ghost premiere. Come with me. Right now, the mingling is done. The stars are in, the stage is set, and it's time for the grand premiere of Banana Island Ghost the movie. Were you a friendly ghost though? Yeah. Or a naughty one? I think you were a naughty one. Yeah, it's a mixture of both. A naughty, friendly ghost, yeah. No, no evil? No, 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 no. Definitely not evil, not evil. I, I don't think I should say that, but I just say no powders. No powders. <laughs> the trailer made the action look amazing. And I'm just looking forward to them giving us excellence. Like, it looked like they really and then of course Chigong and my boy Aka, I'm too excited for him. Like I'm too excited for him. I know he's been nervous about tonight. Do you have any particular ghost story that you want to share with us today? I don't think so. I've never just believed in. I think I learned my, um, the Lord is my shepherd quite early. Oh, wow. So I, I always just used it as. You saved, you saved yourself a lot of emotional trauma, I must say. No Ojuju scares, no. No, Igodo and all those other movies, no? None whatsoever. This film will play across a huge demographics in terms of age, you know. Whereas you look at a cinema, primary cinema going audience between maybe 18 and 30 or 35, 
this film will play for those guys and play for the 45 plus year olds. You know, that's what we want. Now there's pictures and shots, air kisses and hugs going on all around. See what I did there? <laughs> We're still at the premiere of Banana Island Ghost and the atmosphere is generally extra, extra hyped. Unfortunately though, it's time for me to say goodbye to all of you watching. Thank you all so much for staying tuned. I'm Mimi Onolaja. This has been BVIP Events. This remains Ebony Live TV and we'll see you guys real soon. Life.